Hello, everyone. My name is Blanca Cortez. I am a community manager at JP Morgan Chase, and I'm supporting and uplifting my local community here in Los Angeles. And this program, wow, it's been so life changing. Um, before the program, I felt empty, unfulfilled. I was in corporate America for 13 years, and I just felt like I was missing something. And I was introduced to this program th through a dear friend named Lily Rocha. And I was like, oh, I'm, I'm ready to take on this like executive leadership program. But I had no idea what I signed up for. <laughs> it took me through a personal um, journey in developing myself, understanding who I am, what do I want in life? What are my values? What's my purpose? I never took a step back and took a moment to understand me. And what do I want to get out of life? And what do I want my legacy to be? And this program gave me the safe space, the sisterhood, the amazing advisors that we had on board. And it just allowed me to really develop that and understand that it's okay to take a moment and to focus on me for the first time. I was always so focused on the outside, the external world, the accomplishments. And no matter each milestone that I reached, I still didn't feel fulfilled because I never did that internal work. So it allowed me the space to do that, as well as really discover what I want to do in life, which was to uplift my community. But I got lost in corporate America um, with that passion and that purpose. And I was able to, to look back and say, you know what, I want to make a change. I really want to be in my sweet spot. And I had an amazing opportunity that was brought up to me actually in February before the program started in March. And I was like, oh, it seems interesting. It's it's all about the community, financial literacy, education, uplifting others, the underserved, the un unbankable. And I was interested, but something, I was a little nervous. I was like, oh, I don't know. I'm so used to being in commercial banking and sales and dealing with, with um, commercial clients. And I realized like, wow, God is sending me this message and this gift. And I need to um, look for my, look, look at this program and the foundation it provided me and the support group and the sisters and and ask them for guidance. And it all showed up to say, lean in, to have that courage and move forward and make the change. And I'm fortunate enough to say, I've been in my role for two months now, and I still cannot believe I am in my sweet spot doing what I love um, and focusing on people that need it the most. And I also use uh, one of Dr. Yasmin David's book about negotiations, about how to negotiate for myself, different tactics, different strategies, and I was able to negotiate a 33% raise doing what I love, which is still, I still cannot believe I'm, I'm in this space and in this current position. And I just want to say that it gave me the, the, also the space to really um, discover who I am as an authentic leader, because I was so used to wearing a mask, trying to fit in, had an imposter syndrome. And I always felt like I wasn't enough and I wasn't worthy or deserving. And I was able to really do the internal work, understand who I am, be confident in my story and in me and just and be me. And it's okay to let, let that guard down and lean in and lead with my heart. And so I just want to say this program really changed my life. It gave me the gift to align my personal passion and purpose to uplift others uh, within my career. And at the same time, I was able to create the sisterhood um, connections and relationships that I lean on all the time. They really led me through that path of self-discovery, which um, to be quite honest, was challenging for me in the beginning. But as I, I just uh, believed in the magic and in the process and it all flourished. So thank you so much for allow, allowing me this space to, to share my story.